Jason, share the story on how the Roadhammers formed and really the tight bond between you and the guys. Well, you know, uh, I was, you know, doing my solo thing and, you know, just really just loving singing country music. And I was talking to a fellow who was uh, heading CMT. And I, I said, man, I'd really love to do this concept album of kind of like trucker songs from when I was a kid. His name's Ted Ellis. He said, well, we want to do a TV show, you putting that together. And that was back in 05. And it just so happened that, that it all came together just even better than we could have ever dreamed. Chris Byrne uh, was bass player in my band at the time, best bass player in the world, super singer-songwriter, and all-around great guy who lives in your fair city there right in Calgary. And, uh, and then Clayton Bellamy comes along and just explodes, and I'm like, this is the guy we need, and he's from up in Cold Lake. So uh, it just happened. And then Corbett Fraz. Uh, our original drummer, just super, super drummer, great guy, one of the funniest guys you'd ever want to meet and tour with, just awesome to hang with. And uh, it was just a wonderful, wonderful uh, creation. We, You couldn't have imagined it starting any better. You know, Jason, you were touching on your solo career, and your album, uh, Greatest Times of All, was released in 1989. How have you grown as an artist uh, since breaking <laughs> out into music? How have I grown as an artist since 89? I can sum it up in one word. Old. <laughs> well, you know, older, shall I say. But uh, it's been great because I've, I've had more than, way more than my fair share of uh, opportunities as a solo artist and then um, and to work with, you know, amazing team, our, our record company, Open Road, and, and all of them who've really been the machine behind what I do and what I've done and, and now with what the Hammers do. And then getting to work with Clay and Chris and, and everybody, it's like... I just you can't compress that much blessing into one one lifetime. So it's it's hard to I don't know, sometimes it's hard to sit back and absorb. We've we've been so blessed to do what we love to do for a living. You guys have had a lot of success as the Road Hammers, uh, multiple awards. If you could pick one time in your life that, you know, really stands out for you still, what would that be? But I would have to say right now. I mean, uh, with the release of Zamboni, this is something that, you know, when we think we've written about everything that has wheels, you know, literally. We've written everything about wheels because that's what we do we like to write songs about travel on the open road and uh, here we are with zamboni and it's it's kind of tying in you know our our national sport with with uh, the one thing we all want to do when we're at the hockey game and that's drive the zamboni <laughs> so it's uh right now is a great time to be a, a hammer it's a good time to be alive I've always wondered, Jason, of course, you guys released a cover of Jerry Reed's uh, popular song, Eastbound and Down. Has Jerry ever heard that version? You know what? He did. Uh, this is interesting. I have a place in Nashville, and right across the road from me, it's this area where there's a bunch of publishers and stuff. His, one of his uh, managers, his, the last manager he had before he passed, uh, had played him our, our version of it. I had the opportunity to write with Jerry about six months before he passed away. He was in bad health, but he still was writing songs. And uh, he wasn't able to the week that I was able to write. He was not feeling well. Um, but I did never get to meet him. But I do know for a fact that he did hear our version. He said, man, that's pretty cool. That's <laughs> so awesome. just to know Jerry Reed said that and heard our, our version is awesome. Yeah, let's talk about this new song right now called Zamboni, a truly Canadian song. You have Tim Hortons in there, Tara Sloan from Hockey Night in Canada. Tell us the story yep. behind uh, Zamboni. This, wow, what an amazing thing. Uh, a friend of mine you know, in Barrie, Ontario here, he owns uh, the Barrie Colts hockey team, OHL team. And uh, he started out as a musician years ago. Then he got into business, did quite well, and, of course, bought a hockey team. And we met a few years ago and started to uh, write songs together. Uh, and he said, you know what would be cool is to have some sort of anthem to play when the Zamboni comes out in between the intermission. And uh, I said, all right. So we just started coming up with this little idea. And, and then we recorded it. And he had a friend at Tim Hortons, and he said, hey, what do you think of doing a video with? And then next thing, one thing leads to another, and there's Zamboni. What's the reaction been so far? Oh, it's been great. We played, uh, gosh, we played hometown hockey uh, with Ron McLean and then Tara Sloan, of course, who's in the video. If you go to YouTube and just put in Zamboni, it's the first thing that comes up, the Road Amers video. Uh, it's it's awesome. I mean, this it's not really a radio song per se. Maybe it is. I know lots of stations are playing it, which blows my mind. We just wanted to have fun and maybe some teams play it at intermissions. And and uh, we've got people sending us videos of their kids singing it and on front of the TV and all that kind of stuff. So, I mean, that's, I don't know, that's kind of what makes it all worth it. It's just fun. It is a cool song. Uh, of course, CCMAs are coming to Calgary this summer. Will you and the guys be here? Oh, yeah. We're, we're going to be there. Uh, gosh, we're... 
We've got a bunch of dates that we're going to be announcing here in the next few weeks uh, for our spring touring and then through our summer. But, I mean, you know, with Clay and Chris both being in Alberta, we're pretty much, uh, well, I'm in Ontario. I'm the odd man out, right? But I was I was born in Ontario, but I was raised in Camrose, near Camrose in Edberg, Bashaw area. So I always say I'm from Ontario, but don't hate me because I was raised right. <laughs> but, uh, but we'll be out Alberta way for sure this summer. Jason McCoy joining us. Uh, Jason, what's the coolest thing? About being a road hammer. Oof. Getting to uh, share the stage with an enormously talented group of guys, uh, Chris Byrne, Clayton Bellamy, and, and, and Stephen Broadhurst on drums, and our crew, and uh, just realizing every time we get to step on a stage that we're, well, I get to be part of something and rub shoulders with something that's just greater than the sum of its parts. It really is something, and that all comes from the road hammer fans, you folks at radio, so thanks for uh, you know letting us do what we love to do for a living.